So cute. Oh my goodness, look how big this Lush box is. It's so big, oh my goodness. Oh my oh. goodness, me. Oh, this is so big, holy moly. It's actually like a workout car in it. Oh my god oh my goodness this weighs 8.1 kilograms that is so heavy oh i'm so excited hello everyone welcome back to luscious groovy so today i'm showing you all my massive and when i mean massive i mean this is like small this is big and this is massive a massive halloween haul so i did a massive order my friend kindly ordered it for me josie um, and I did a Christmas and a Halloween order together. However, everything, there's so much of it, I thought I'd split it into a Halloween haul and a Christmas haul. And as Halloween is first, I was like, do a Halloween haul. So today you're going to see all the Halloween products I got. I hope you enjoy. I think, first of all, I'm going to start off with bath bombs. Two Monsters Balls bath bombs, and these were £4.50 each. So the little description on the Lush site says, I spy with this little eye something beginning with boo. This monster mashup of lime and the rainy oils is a sure fire way to, to get the party started. Toss into a hot bath and watch it go. Olabanium oil relaxes and leaves you feeling franken fine all night long. I like that franken fine, Frankenstein. So the main ingredients are uh, lime oil, neroli oil, and olabanium oil. Now these share the Kalaka scent, and I do think this year they've shrunk a bit. That one has a little crack in. So cute, and I think it's cute for Halloween because sometimes people don't like scary stuff for Halloween, and this is cute, and it smells so good. I apologize, because there's so much glitter here. Next up, I have Ectoplasm Jelly Bath Balm. Now this will be the first jelly bath bomb I've ever tried, so I'm very intri intrigued to try this. It smells like fresh oranges, but with a hint of burnt toffee. That's really nice, and I love the colours of it, and this was £4.95. So the main ingredients in Ectoplasm Bath Bomb are tangerine oil, grapefruit oil, and Lipsy Cubea oil. So tangerine oil has a great brightening effect on the skin, and it also helps improve the circulation of the blood. It also promotes the growth of new cells and tissues, so it's basically just reviving the skin. Well, this was on the kitchen, and this was at the summit, and look how cute the little ghost thing is. Are you gonna call Ghostbusters? And then I have my babies. I have my babies back in stock. I have one, two, three Lord of Miserable bath bombs. So the main ingredients in Lord of Miserable bath bomb are black pepper oil, patchouli oil, vanilla absolute, and gardenia extract. And these are just patchouli goodness. These contain a lot of black pepper, patchouli oil, um, vanilla, vanilla pod infusion, tonka. And when this bathroom goes in the water, it lets out like a beautiful, like spewy red colour and green. And it's got popping candy in the middle. And this is beautiful. Like, if I could recommend a bath bomb from this range this year, I would definitely say Lord of Miserable. It's such a lovely bath bomb. I will stock up on more of these, but I was like, free will last me for a while. So, so this is an overview of all the Halloween bath bombs I purchased. So next, I'm going to do bubble bars. Look how glittery I am, oh my goodness. Two of the pink pumpkin bubble bars. There's so much glitter. And basically, people were saying, like, when pictures of these were leaked, people were saying they look like a cat's bottom. I don't see that. To me, it just looks like a beautiful pink, cute pumpkin. Like, this is so nice because at Halloween, like, with Monsters Ball, if you don't like all the, like, the gruesome things about it, this is cute. This is, like, unicorn-like themed. I sniff, it smells of rose jam, but then when I smell it again, it's kind of got more of a musky scent to it. So the main ingredients in Pink Bubble Bar are Jasmine Absolute Bergamot Oil geranium oil and lemon oil this is beautiful this one must a little pod and this is good the size of this though i was a bit disappointed with the size like last year these were definitely bigger this is another really full but um pumpkin bubble bar was bigger it's about this big so it's about the size of a big bath melt turns out what i just filmed didn't record so i'm gonna have to start like half of my haul again so next up we have pumpkin bubble bar this retailed for £4.25 each. It's definitely smaller this year. It has a beautiful luster, as you can tell. 
Um, and I would say you could get about how many uses? I'd say two uses if you want it as a luxurious bubble bath, and maybe three to four, even three to six if you wanted like that with a bath bomb. So on the Lush site it says, I guess you think you know this story, you don't. There's really one much more foamy. Mind you, Dara got the bit right. The bit where, in the dead of the night, the ugly sisters, jewels and all, departed from the palace ball. While darling little Cinderella was locked up in a slimy cello, she bellowed, help and let me out. The magic fairy heard her shout. She answered, Cindy, keep your call and I shall send you to the ball. Cindy said, don't make me laugh, I'd much prefer a steamy bath. It's like, I feel like whenever anyone thinks of Lush Halloween, or me anyway, I automatically think of this bubble bath. When I first saw the Lush leaks of the Halloween products um, for this year, and I saw that there was a cat bubble bath, my heart was complete. I was like, Lush, you have done it, thank you so much. So as I got five cats, it was very appropriate for me to get five bewitched bubble bars for a bubble bath for each cat. That's my excuse for myself. This is Bewitched Bubble Bar, and there's so many good things about it. First of all, it shares um, the blackberry scent. Second of all, it's a cat, and third of all, it's black. So I was like, I can have a black bath, which is like a cat, and smells of blackberry. I was like, what more could you want? So I got five of these. I probably can't put five in my hand, but I'll insert a clip of like all of them. So on the Lush site, it says, after a busy day whizzing around on a broomstick, ground yourself with or Ballium, be spellbound by bergamot, to twitch your nose and breathe in this familiar blackberry scent. Whether in this life or one or the other H, you will be a fool to let this pass you by. And the main ingredients of this bubble bar are bergamot oil and olibalium oil. And then finally, I have two products left. The next one I will insert a clip of because I can't really show it because it's the price of my products on it. So if you, haven't, if you haven't guessed already, um, I got a Halloween knot wrap and I adore the Lush knot wraps. I try and wear them in my hair sometimes, but sometimes I can't because my hair's a bit, I just don't like my hair. Skull knot wrap, which, the um, reason why I got this, first of all because it's skulls and it's like funky, the colours, but third of all, it's like groovy in the title, so I was like, I need this knot wrap so badly. So I got that knot wrap and I love it so much and that was 4 dollars I did my order. Um, and I said to her, there was about five pound left, so I was like, just surprise me with something random with it. Josie knows me better than I know myself, and she bloody well does with this. So, she got picked up for me black rose lip tint. First of all, it's black. Second of all, it shares the yummy mummy scent. I can't contain my excitement. It shares the yummy mummy scent. This smells so good. That. The funny thing about this is, looks black. <gasps> That's weird. It's pink. It's amazing. It's like you look like you have a black. Your soul looks black, but you're full of like beautiful colours on the inside. Um, all the Halloween and Christmas products will be in stores on the sixth of October. So there's not long to wait now. So thank you all so much for watching my Halloween haul. Um, I know I always say this. I apologise for looking a mess. It's the end of a college day, and you know what? I wanted to show you all that I got. So thank you so much for watching. Please know that I'm not trying to brag. My hauls are my most watched video. So I was like, I need to do this haul video. <laughs> so stay tuned for my, my massive Christmas haul. Give this video a like if you liked it. Comment down below if you saw your favorite product and comment down below what you're gonna be stop, stocking up on. And um, subscribe to my channel for more Lush related videos. Comment down below any demos you'd like of any of these products or any videos you would like to see. Most importantly, stay safe, remember you are loved and stay groovy. Bye. So cute.